Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. We've got a special video for you today. Keep watching to see more of Muffin's first cat show. Before we got into the haul, I didn't get this on camera. She got checked over by a vet just to make sure she's healthy and everything's okay with her before we actually got her into the haul and started brushing her up. Some last minute touch ups before the judges came round to have a look. Um, my show buddy that I got assigned by the cat club when I entered, she's just giving me a hand telling me where I should brush over just before I put her into the pen. As you can see, her pen kit's in there. Just got her in the pram giving her the touch-ups the pram is so useful for our show by the way um, we drove up there it was about an hour and a half drive there's 220 cats there so it was a busy busy day this was after we got kicked out for the judging and we were allowed back in it's so just some side classes being judged here after all the main classes are judged um, during that period you normally get told to leave the hall and that's when all of the big classes type as a best of breed stuff like that so in a minute we're gonna go around all of the pens and see some of the different cats so I was at the Manchester and District Cat Club show and the British Ragdoll Cat Club show as I said, it's Muffin's first show. I was so excited to be there. I've never been at a cat show before. So to even be there just as like a spectator was really exciting. As you can see, lots of the cats had um, rosettes on their pens. When they've got a rosette, that means they won. If you're wondering why the quality looks a little bit worse on this clip than the first one, it's because this is taken from a TikTok live. I actually went live on TikTok. I showed all the different cat breeds and stuff. So sit back and relax, take a look at the kitties with me and enjoy the rest of the vlog. I'm gonna come back with a voiceover when I need to, but for now, just take a look at all the pretty little kitties. We've got some beautiful Devon Rex kitties here. This one I kept calling the Bat Cat because it was just like a Batman kitty. I don't know, it's just giving me Batman vibes. You'll see a lot of the cats in the pens. They have litter trays in there, but most of them like to either lie in it or just kick the litter around the pen. So <laughs> as you can see, I don't know if that's a boy or a girl cat in this pen. I can't really make out the video, but yeah, they've kicked the litter absolutely everywhere and the little blanket as well is just normally all over the pen. Luckily Muffin didn't do it at the show, but a lot of the cats did. It's quite funny. Um, I've never actually seen this breed in person before. It's a Selkirk Rex. They really remind me of teddy bear cats. I don't know, they're just so cute. I mean, a furry, long-haired, curly cat I have okay. never seen in my whole life. I didn't even know they existed. Did you? Tell me in the comments. I thought this next cat looked a bit like Tony, you know, all white. It was a British short hair and I thought it was really cute. Simply for the fact that it just reminded me of Tony. <laughs> Who's ready for the 
the big reveal, dun dun dun. Muffin, oh my gosh, look how much she won. She won so much, I was so proud of her. She's sitting in a pen. Look how good she is as well, she hasn't kicked anything anywhere. I didn't actually use litter in the litter tray. I decided on the advice of my show body to use some kitchen towels, just in case she decided to kick it everywhere. It looks a lot neater. The water's at the back, um, just for Muffin to have a drink. Muffin won best by colour neuter, breed class first, best of breed and an open first. The first three rosettes were from the British Ragdoll Cat Club and the open first rosette was from the Manchester Cat Club. So I'm really proud of her. She also got two seconds and um, she got two premier certificates. So she needs one more premier certificate to get her first premier title. I'm so proud of her. I can't believe how well she did. It was super worth it. And it was super worth going to see all the other pretty cats. And I learned so much. I met so many great people and yeah i can't wait for our next one our next show is actually june the 18th that'll be in coventry here i'm just talking about different rosettes and as i said earlier this was actually a clip from tiktok live so i did go live on the day it was really exciting for people who are tuning in because i got to see the results live and yeah a lot of these shows you'll find are open to the public so if you are interested in attending shows or getting into it it's great to go to one beforehand you can actually find out the show schedules on the gccf um website so everything will be up there details of times dates places and how you can enter will be on there if you need any more help on trying to enter catch show if you want some details a little bit of info maybe you just want to ask me a question feel free to pop me a message over on instagram or facebook all of our social media links are in the description i'd love to hear from you and yeah i'm totally excited for our next one and i would love to uh, help expand the showing community because i feel like there's so many people out there that want to show but they just don't know how to go about it and um thankfully the British Ragdoll Cat Club are really, really helpful. They're so friendly. Their show manager actually reached out to me and paired me with the show body. So my show body, Paula, helped me through all of it. We were talking back and forth on Facebook beforehand. And another thing that's great about the shows, at the end, when you've got all the judging done, you can go around and see all your few favourite cats again. I've just added in some cheeky little clips of the cats getting judged because I thought it's so cute. As you can see, the judges are really in depth. They feel through the coat. There's Muffin getting judged. I thought this clip was really just like, oh, I'm never going to forget this moment now. I've got it on video. This is the top show pen, so like top best of breed. Um, these are getting judged now. As you can see, all the top show pens behind this is like the best bit of the day, basically. Um, you get to see all of the top winners everyone's a big part of it as well as you can see we're all standing around waiting for it to happen my show buddy's cat actually made it to the top pens and here they are getting judged in the center this beautiful cat that's on the end was in the pen next to me as well and they took home the top prize i think oh here's the household pets getting judged for the um manchester show so i believe the big black boy in the middle won something special because look at how spectacular is they're all clapping away Woo! it's quite a big day for a lot of these guys especially the breeders the owners you get to see some really cute cats and of course here i am showing off my show girl i hope you all enjoyed this vlog and i was really excited to find Finally get it finished for you all it's taken me quite a while to edit all these clips together and find all the right different pictures and stuff so i really hope you enjoyed thanks for watching make sure you like comment share and subscribe to this channel and check out the description for links and as i say if you need any advice on showing or getting into it feel free to pop me a dm thanks for watching and see you next time guys